Mullet Man Trucking here. Ah. Here again in beautiful Springfield, Missouri. Just having a great, great time. Hope everyone is having a great time as well. While you're watching this lovely face with your lovely face. If you want to join the Mullet Club, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click that little bell icon if you want to get notified of all my new content when it goes live. Yes, another great day. Another great day. Yes, it is. I hope everybody's having a great day themselves. So, as you can probably tell by the beginning of this video, I now have a CPAP machine. Yes, I do. <laughs> Fun times ensue. Fun times ensue. But I hope everyone is just having a lovely day. I don't know how many times I'm going to say that in this video, but. I always stay positive. Everything hits me. I, boom! I bounce right back off and stay positive, y'all. So what happened today happened this week. So I haven't really posted much because there ain't really been that many updates. I got a few different updates for this video, so I hope y'all enjoy. So I, I met my TNT trainer this week. His name is... Sheik? Yeah, Sheik. Uh, he is... He's, it looks like he's going to be a cool guy. I uh, hope I learned a lot from him here in TNT. Hopefully, I'm actually leaving tonight. If not, I'll be leaving in the morning for New York. All right. Ain't never been there before, but let's go. Riding. All right. So, I had to do a sleep study um, because my past train thought I did have sleep apnea. And, well, once you know, it's confirmed. I have sleep apnea. I should have severe sleep apnea. So I'm actually glad, I'm 100% glad that that was caught right now. There's other drivers that upset they have to get this machine and all that kind of thing, but I'm actually glad when I saw them results today. So I had to sleep study from like 10 to about 6 o'clock in the morning, uh, last night to this morning. And today I got the results. Wow. I tell you what, I'm looking at those results and I'm going, I should have had this thing sooner. I mean, I had my oxygen drop down to like 70% without a CPAP mask on. That's not good. You want to be in the 90s while you're sleeping. That's not That's not good. That's not healthy. I had like 90 different uh, episodes of sleep apnea while I uh, while I was actually uh, in like REM sleep. But if I was not in REM sleep, I was still at like 40 episodes. That's not good, y'all. So I definitely needed this machine. I'm not upset about it. Yes, it's going to cost me a lot of money. It's like $80 a week. But I'm 100% glad that I now know I have this so I can, you know, I, I can get better sleep. That's that's how I, I see it. But yeah, I get getting on a TNT truck either tonight or in the morning. So that's going to be fun. That will be really, really fun. So, um... Without further to do, I guess that's really my update for today. I hope I hope y'all enjoy these updates. I'm going to try to get them more frequent, but it really, it just depends through this train. Once I get in my own truck, and I probably will be going lease, and I was originally saying I was going to go team company, but I'm probably going to lease when I get out of here. But um, I'll go ahead and just leave you there, I guess. I hope... Um, I hope y'all are ready for the next video because it should be exciting. I'm trying to get a little footage of um, going down the road a little bit. We'll see how that works. But other than that, I have one final question for you today. And that is, what is one thing that really just makes your life complete? What is one thing that you really appreciate every single day? See y'all in the next one, y'all. Have a great day.